Let's get to it. Heavy lake effect snow right now across the southern tier. This is where it's going to continue for a few more hours. Some of this here is going to come down and bring us a few snow showers. All in all, today's pretty quiet, but heavy snow will continue for Cattaraugus and Chautauqua counties for a little while longer. Also down into the South Towns, we've got a little bit of light snow as well. But the big story is the lake effect snow starting again tonight. All right, this little disturbance out here. This is the kicker that's going to start that flow of uh, cold air over a warm lake, and that's going to set the stage for heavy lake effect snow during the day today. It is pretty quiet with just a few snow showers. It starts at about eight, nine o'clock with heavy snow setting up right over Buffalo tonight, and it will be heavy. It then will likely settle over the South towns and become very heavy by tomorrow morning, including Buffalo, including in to places like East Aurora, Orchard Park, West Seneca, Hamburg, and it snows all day long. This is where you have that reminiscence of some of the historic and classic lake effect snow events. OK, then what happens is on Friday night it continues, but on Saturday is when it begins to lift up into Buffalo. This is a narrow, intense area of lake effect snow. One thing we're watching, and this is critical in terms of snowfall totals, is how quickly this band of no, uh, snow lifts up into Niagara Falls on Saturday. This is showing that it does move up there into the afternoon and maybe even into Canada for a while before coming back down on Sunday. Sunday morning, the snow will return, but by Sunday afternoon, the snow will begin to fade. So by the Bills game, the weather should be okay. OK, an overview of snowfall totals here. We're still in that 28 to 36 range, but I wanted to take another look at another simulation that has just come in and this really targets again Buffalo into the immediate South Towns with that 28 to 36 inch zone of heavy snow. And you can kind of follow the contours. If you label them all, it would get really crowded, but you can kind of see pick your area and you can see where the north south cutoff is. Remember, if you are not in the snow band, the weather's OK. When you're in the snow band, that's where things can be treacherous, dangerous driving, especially tomorrow, which is why I got to believe people are going to stay home. Schools, people, workers, I mean, it's just going to be nuts in that snow band and continuing into Saturday. Lake effect snow will really hit hard on in Niagara County later uh, Saturday into early Sunday for Buffalo all three days through uh, Sunday morning for the South towns. We're going to get a break on Saturday. Same with the southern tier with some light snow continuing on Sunday.